pretty All sure right. Australia right now fishing. The blue waters. Looking for some marlin or something, I'm not really sure. Tuna. No. Marlin. Not tuna. Nope. I, I don't have that good of an accent. It's okay. It's more like British. We only been here for a bit, so we're still learning, you know. Yeah. <sighs> Ain't getting nothing on that one. Yeah. <laughs> So, we're here in the Australian waters, just like while you're in Afghanistan, you know, so. Yeah, enjoying life. Yeah, you're probably having more fun than us shooting at those towels and stuff, though. Probably. We had a good summer so far. Chilling, shooting rabbits. That's shooting. it. Yep. <laughs> I got a job working construction and stuff. It's not too bad. I'm like a real pro at picking up trash. I'm not very good at improv. Yep. Oh yeah, so when you get back, we're going on vacation or something, Steve tells me. Yep. I ruled out Sierra's though, because it's going to be snow and I ain't fishing in the snow. Big Bear. After this trip in Big Australia. Bear. So we're thinking about Big Bear so far. Um, we, could, we could stay at Grandpa's place. If it's not available, or if it is available, for about four days, that'd be cool. We could and use every single room, too. Yeah, we're bringing the bass boat. Three of them. Yep, no one. Oh, yeah, just one. Split the gas into three ways. Or oh, two ways, you and Steve. <laughs> yeah. Hey, we have something we're going to show you. We're sending you these. Oh, right, yeah. Close up, close up. <laughs> oh, sweet aromatic. They cost me an arm and a leg. Yep. They're expensive. Oh, Australia. cigars. Sweet. Yep. Five minutes ain't caught nothing yet. Nope, nothing here in Alaska. It's actually pretty hot here. What are we doing in Alaska? We're crab fishing. With fishing poles? No, we got a crab line top. Alright. <laughs> yep, well, that's what we're doing. <laughs> I thought that's what we were doing, but then you all changed it up. Oh. Well, we might as well fish while we're crab fishing. That's dumb. Get some halibut. Nope. Salmon. Yep. Halibut. Hey, say, who's that floating oh, in the water? Oh, no! Man overboard! Get him! Oh! What, the, what is this? Oh, oh my. Rocky, what are you doing in there? <laughs> oh, he must have swam all the way out here. I know. Jeez. Good well, thing he's safe. Hey, say hi to Gavin, Rocky. We're just going to keep him for the rest of the time. I'm done fishing with the pole. We're yeah. catching nothing. Yeah, let's bring these, these crab lines in and see what we got here. All right. So we hear you're coming back in October, that's good. Yeah. At least we know we have enough time for our presents to get there. <laughs> uh, what else? Yeah, yeah. Hey Gavin, on a serious note, a little update. Um, let's see here, I lost a total of 17 pounds and I bought a kayak. I just went kayak fishing like yesterday. But he ate a whole entire gallon of Ben and Jerry's ice cream. No, today, not a gallon, so a quart. The, no, a pint. It was a gallon. And no. now he's up to 290. No, so, no. Yeah. I'm on the video, still, it doesn't look like yeah. it, but okay. trust me, real I'm still life, seven, it's bad. I'm still 17 Plus, pounds left. Shut up. That's John. not true. Yes. Oh, Anyways. Dude, it's bad. Okay, well, I'm going to keep fishing and hopefully I'll lose weight. Anyways, Xavier's. Yeah, because this is a good workout. <laughs> Well, no, I bought a kayak so you can paddle long distances. Yeah. No. I seen you paddle. Okay. Anyways, Xavier's coming back within a week and it's late. Two weeks. Or what is it? The first or second of August or something like that? Nah, he comes back sometime in August. He doesn't know yet. So. Well, I mean, from this day, two weeks at the most. One week at, is what we're expecting, though. So, yeah. They're going to Hawaii, I think. Hang out with the fam. Somebody told me that. Yeah, so, Xavier wants to go party it up. I tested it. Sure. Yeah. Steve told me about the Las Vegas ball in uh, Las Vegas. On the 18th? On the 18th, so 
definitely thinking about that. Yep. Uh, that would be fun. I we wonder. I wonder if you're gonna bring Diana now. again. Yeah, don't bring Diana because I might make. She her wasn't cry too again. bad. She was bad. No, yeah. you're just dumb. Yeah, but, but we do need to bring more girls, I think. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, but thinking about you a lot. Stay sure. safe out there, man. Yeah. Yeah, because if something bad happens, then it's not really fun for us. Either. Yeah. So you better come back. Man. Yeah, think about your friends and family. Yeah, don't be selfish. <laughs> <laughs> we almost got killed that one time where we did go on rabbit hunting and that dragon flew by and made that noise. Oh yeah, big Dude. dragon, that forty was feet crazy. long. Crazy, just just barely missed us. Breathing fire. Yeah. Luckily, it lit our fire though. It was freezing. Yeah. And uh, we spent the night there. And. Uh, but seriously, on a serious note, we didn't see a dragon. We heard this crazy noise. sounded like a dragon. Because it was a dragon. I saw it. Steve okay. Did. Well, anyways, we told Catherine this, and she totally believed us. And Miranda. Yeah, and they were, they were like, into it, like, what? No way. <laughs> that was funny. We had Catherine going for a couple of days, but Miranda found out. Like, well, that's because we told Miranda last. And, of course, we told Catherine it was a lie. We told Miranda it was a lie, which turned out to be dumb. So, Still funny though. Also, we're going to the drive-in tonight. We're watching this movie called Cowboys and Aliens, Crazy Stupid Love, and with Steve Carell. Captain America is out now. It's supposed yes, to be Captain BA. Freaking America. Yeah, with the shield, you know, with the star on it. Yep. Red, white, and blue. That's America. If I can talk to him, I'm gonna send him to Afghanistan, and then he'll teach you his ways, yep. which are pretty cool. Dude, completely random. It might make you laugh, though. I don't know. So Eric Hester just bought this F-150 for like six grand of his own money. Only had liability insurance. Parked it in an Indian Hills camp. Left it for two hours. Caught itself on fire. Toast. Completely burnt to the ground. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> yeah, so he lost $6,000. Yep. I'm going to buy a Saturn next weekend. Yep. It's uh, $1,200. No got power 100, steering. Got 100,000 miles on it. Stick shift, close to 40 miles a gallon. Manual steering. <laughs> yep. And, uh, yeah, got a good deal on it, so I'm going to buy it. I make $15 an hour right now, so it's actually pretty good. I'm getting paychecks, steady work. I still get paid 10 bucks an hour. Steve still gets paid 10 bucks an hour. I've been working at this job for about oh, a month. To make more than Steve. I'm looking for a raise soon. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> so. But yeah, dude. Yeah. Uh, going to Tim McGraw or Toby Keith concert on August 12th. So that should be pretty awesome. Yep. Gonna um, party it up with some country girls. Should come. I'll take pictures of them for you and send them to you. I know it's illegal, but. I like it. Yeah, especially because they're not even 18 yet, Shana. I don't want to take just pictures kidding. of the ones with their mom. But dude. Yeah, man, Big Berry, I sent you a video last. Uh, I didn't tell you how many fish we caught. We caught more than you can count. Like, we were dropping. Before it even hit the bottom, we had a trout. That's how it went most of the time, dude. Every night was like that. So we got Chris, Caroline, uh, Nathan, Luke. Uh, everybody jammed in the in the cab of the boat so that we can get their limits, and we we, we would just we catch so many trout, dude. Steve was happier than when he went to the gay bar last week. Oh, I which did not. is excited. Dude, why do you make this crap up? I did See, not go to the gay bar. He's denying it because he is gay. It's just dude, it's I am not gay. I've I am not gay. Sean was gay. You. He's, he posted on Facebook that he was gay, dude. He posted on Facebook. He came out of the closet. Steve posted on Facebook that he thinks he has a small wiener. Oh, no. You like, posted on my whoa, profile. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And That's I saw... not true. He was asking other dudes what oh size my is God. normal. I was not. Yeah, and Mrs. <laughs> Vasquez commented on it and told him. So... Pretty sure he was thinking that he was big at three inches, but Miss Vasquez said that she had one like four foot long. Dude, he freaking hacked my Facebook, and it was on there for a good day. It was bad. It was awesome. So he had no idea. He says he's gonna get me back, but he I'm hasn't too let crafty. me yet. I'm crafty. 
I'm the best, and also I would like to let you know that Steve is inferior. <laughs> also, some awesome comments for, from Steve is, hey, that owl looks more like a bird. Okay. Also, we saw a hawk, and Steve goes, look, a hawk. And Robbie goes, no, that's an owl. And Steve's like, no, it's not. Owls don't have beaks. <laughs> so those are some classic ones from okay. Steve as of recent. Oh, and also there's that one at Nate and Christie's mm. where I said, um, how, do you how do you light the stove? But it was an electric stove. So he was looking for a lighter. A dumb question to ask. He has an electric stove at his house. Anyways, Nate and Christy want to say hi too. So they're thinking about y'all, so. Um. Yep. Oh, possibly. Or oh, yeah, they're pregnant again. Crazy. Oh, yeah, having another Dude. baby. Both of them, Nate and Christy, are pregnant. Nate's going to get neutered. Nate's going to pee out a baby <laughs> out of his penis. And then, uh, let's see. What else? Oh, Miranda had a boyfriend. And broke up, or they both, it was a mutual breakup. Miranda dumped him because he didn't have enough time for her, because he was working and she wasn't, yeah, so. so she was lonely. It was mutual, dude. It was she didn't mutual. break up That's with him. That's why, she dumped him. Okay, because She whatever. canned him for okay. no reason. She did. She, she did. She totally did. Steve got another girlfriend, let me tell you, she was a beast. She's actually a stripper at one point in her life, but she turned around. She is... Yeah, tell me about it. Turned dude. around, gained 700 pounds. Oh, my God. Okay? She get hold on a steel frame and bend it. <laughs> Just kidding, dude. I do not have a girlfriend. I'm still single. As is Shano. But he's going on a date tomorrow night with Carly. But he's not buying, so... In my book, it's not an official date, but it's still working towards the it's end date goal. if I kiss her, right, Gavin? No. Yeah, get back to me on that, because <laughs> I think that that's a date. No, dude. Steve doesn't. There's people that hook up every night. That's Again, not a date. Steve's gay, because he thinks that guys shouldn't kiss I'm just girl. more sentimental than Shauna, that's all. Steve's also gay. No. Sentimental's a sign of gayness. It is not. Yep. Nope. Yeah. It is. Nope. Steve's watching Battlestar Galactica, another sign of him being gay. No. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is so not true. Uh, I am watching Battlestar, but that is an awesome show. He goes fishing with only dudes, makes him gay. I fish with girls all the time. What you when was the last time you fished with a girl? Jill and Molly. All the time. Who are they? My hands. Oh. <laughs> I won this game on the Wii at Nate and Christie's where you go like this. Oh yeah. On Mario Party on the Wii, dude. Yep. I won because I didn't have a girlfriend. <laughs> so. <laughs> Just dominated. That was I was so good, my endurance was stellar. <laughs> About 45 seconds. Dude, let me check the battery on this thing because we might just be talking to no one right now. Oh no, we're still good. Yep, still recording. But, oh, the tape ended. It ended? Yeah, I don't know where it ended.